You're watching Heroes Special. Heroes, a celebration of success. Senator Uche Lilian Ekunife Iyum is a senator of the Federal Republic of Nigeria, representing Anambra Central Senatorial District in the 9th Assembly of the Nigerian Senate. She is currently the chairman, Senate Committee on Science and Technology. Senator Ekunife is a chartered accountant by profession. She was born 12 December 1970 in Onisha, Anambra State, and obtained her Bachelor of Science BSc degree in Business Education and Accounting from the University of Calabar in 1992. She obtained both a postgraduate diploma, PGD, and a master's in business administration from Nnamdi Azikiwe University, Oka, and was conferred with a doctorate degree, honoris causa, in public administration by the Institute of Journalism, Management, and Continuing Education, Enugu. Senator Ekunife is an outstanding personality of great reputation. Her success and achievements in the various positions she has held over time continue to stand her out as one of the most effective leaders of our time. Prior to joining politics, she had a very successful career in banking and rose from branch manager of Standard Trust Bank to head of private banking unit of United Bank for Africa, UBA. Her meteoric rise in the banking profession was propelled by the hard work and dedication she put into her assigned duties, which led her to being elected as president, Young Bankers Association, 2000-2006, and also earned the prestigious title of Young Banker of the Year in 2003. In the political space, Senator Uche Ekunife continues to blaze the trail and break the glass ceilings that restrains the emergence of women as major political players in our country. In June 2007, she was elected into the Federal House of Representatives as member representing Anocha Njikoka, Dunukofia Federal Constituency, where she served for two terms upon her re-election in 2011. While in the House of Representatives, she occupied several leadership positions like the Chairman, House of Committee on Environment, 2011 to 2015, where she displayed very exceptional leadership qualities in tackling the nation's environmental and ecological challenges. As Chairman, Senator Ekunife attracted the attention of the federal government to the havocs and menace caused by erosion in different states of the Federation, and also provided meaningful and practical solutions to these problems. She was also Deputy Chairman, House Committee on Public Accounts, 2007 to 2011, Leader Anambra State Caucus, House of Representatives, 2011 to 2015, and member of several standing committees of the House of Representatives, including Public Accounts, Gas Resources, Public Procurement, Rural Development, Women in Parliament, FCT, and Electoral Matters. She was also a member of ad hoc committees on Petroleum Industry Bill and House Services. Her record of service in this subcommittee were exemplary. Due to the exceptional representation she provided to her constituents during her time in the House of Representatives in June 2015, Senator Ekunife was elected into the Nigerian Senate as Senator representing Anambra Central Senatorial District, a position she held until she was untimely removed by an unfavorable court judgment in November 2015. During this brief period in Senate, Senator Ekunife exhibited an exceptional, impressive ability to work across party lines in the execution of her legislative functions. She was appointed Chairman Senate Committee on Petroleum Downstream, the first time a woman and southerner occupied this eminent position. She was also a member of several ad hoc committees in the 8th Senate, including Committee on Legislative Agenda, Committee on Works, Committee on Rules and Business, and Committee on Ethics, Privileges, and Public Petitions. Senator Ekunife has also participated in several other national assignments including member presidential committee on flood relief and rehabilitation pcfrr and member representing anambra in the house of representatives constitutional amendments committee 2011 to 2014 in 2019 senator ekunife uche was re-elected into the senate this time with a more overwhelming electoral victory margin than 2015. In a feat that had never previously been attained, Senator Ekunife won the election in all seven local government areas in Anambra Central in what is now referred to as authentic seven over seven victory. Her overwhelming victory was a testimony of the people's abiding belief in her quality representation. Senator Ekunife's leadership ability has always manifested everywhere she goes. While serving on the board of Nigerian Film Corporation, she made unparalleled contribution to the development and growth of Nollywood industry. She also served on the board of National Institute of Policy and Strategic Studies, NIPSS. 
Iyom, as she is fondly called, is many things to many people. To a lot of people, she is a role model, a go-getter, a trailblazer. To others, she is a philanthropist who takes delight in helping people. And yet, to many others, she is a leader par excellence, who has given a very good account of every leadership position she has occupied. Indeed, she is so called to many families whose lives she has positively impacted in various ways. To her credit, she has assisted over 670 youth to be employed in both private and public sector. She has also assisted over 107 women travel outside the country either to explore business opportunities or to embark on pilgrimages. Senator Ekunife has participated in various matters of great national importance. She was among the delegates who represented Nigeria in Geneva for the 133rd Assembly of the Interparliamentary Union. She was also a member at her committee on constitutional review and also led different legislative groups at the National Assembly, representatives and Senate. Senator Ekunife have moved several well-reserved motions of great national importance. Some of the bills credited to Senator Uche Ekunife include, among others, the National Project Monitoring Agency Establishment Bill, the LGA Financial Autonomy Bill, a bill for an act to provide for the establishment of the National Environmental Sanitation Commission, NESC, a bill for the act to amend the Environmental Health Officers Registration Act 2002, a bill for an act to establish the Forestry Research Institution of Nigeria, FRIN, and most recently, a bill for an act to amend the Public Procurement Act. Her joy in putting smiles on the faces of people led Senator Ekunife in 2001 to establish a scholarship and welfare scheme for the education of intelligent and indigent students. To date, over 100 students have benefited from this initiative. The Youth and Widows Support Center is also a non-governmental organization which she established to assist youths and widows. Senator Ekunife has undergone several local and international training from reputable institutions around the world like Harvard Business School, Lagos Business School and University of Woodwater-Sand, Johannesburg, South Africa. She has also received several awards of excellence including the Best Honorable Member of House of Representatives 2008 African Meritorious Service Award 2008, Legislative Excellence Award 2009, and Merit Award of Excellence. Senator Ekunife is a fellow of the Nigerian Institute of Marketing, NEMAC, as well as Paul Harris Fellow Rotary International. She has also been conferred with several shifting titles by traditional rulers, including Iyom Ugochinyeleze Nawata Nri, Adugo Iwo, Ibouku, Nnediora Mma Agoata, Anyangu Agoluzi Ibo, Ife Abagana, Akugo Ojoto Ezine Nimo Ugomba Agolo Ojugo Amichi Udala Oma Enugu Agedi Okada Oka Mpuloma Chukukulu Umaolo Achalugo Obuno to mention but a few. She is also a worthy recipient of the Iyom title and has been long standing member of Ndi Aro Eze, special advisors in Inri Kingdom. Senator Ekunife is happily married to her husband of over 25 years, Chief Larry Ekunife Uchendo, and they are blessed with lovely children. If you think that Iyom has a chance of becoming the next governor of Anambra State, do send in your opinion to our emails, to our social media handles and links. We would be glad to hear from you. And for me and my crew, my name is Ifoma Chuku. We wish Iyom the best in her quest to leave Anambra State with motherly love. Heroes special. Heroes, a celebration of success.